Welcome to Messy Monday. I'm Kimberly McCleary, the head of youth services at the Upper Diary Township Library. And for our very first Messy Monday, we are going to be doing shaving cream marbled paper. So the supplies that you need is pretty much a lot of supplies that I was able to grab at home and some things I went out and bought. One of the main things that we need is some type of dish. I just have a regular baking dish here that I'm going to put the shaving cream in. Um, and you can use any type of dish that you have at home. Next, that's going to be most important, um, is some type of heavyweight paper. I grabbed this straight at Target, and you can get it at any store that sells arts and craft. Um, or even if you have cardstock at home, you can use that. Next, we got shaving cream. And it's foaming shaving cream works best. Um, so if you're out buying shaving cream, no gel shaving cream. Next, we just need some food coloring. Um, you can also use any type of paint that you have at home. I got a ruler to scrape off the paint and you can use any type of um, hard edge surface. And we got a spatula so we can kind of smooth out the shaving cream as we go along and a skewer or you can use a toothpick to kind of make our design um, for our, our marbleized shaving cream painting. And last but not least, um, the shaving cream might get messy, so I got a little wet cloth here to wipe my hands just in case if I need to. You can also use just a bowl of water um, to wash off everyone's hands. So this is a really family friendly project that anyone in the family can do at home. So let's get started. So first things first is we need to get our shaving cream spread it out everywhere. Okay, so I'm just going to spread it out. So you're just using your flat spatula or any other utensil that you have in your home to kind of even out the shaving cream within the dish that you're using. I think that's good enough. So now you can add any type of colors all over the shaving cream. I think I'm gonna to try to use every one and I'm just gonna put it anywhere. We'll see what happens. The food coloring can also get a little messy, so it's good to have a wet cloth nearby. So just spreading out the colors good to just let everyone do and put any designs that you want. Alright, now I'm going to make a design. So you're just using your toothpick or skewer or any other utensil that you have to kind of swirl the shaving cream and food coloring together to kind of mix it together for that marbleized look. Now I think we're ready for the paper. Right. So you're gonna take your piece of paper and you wanna make sure that you just kinda of smush it onto the shaving cream. Try to get all the edges of the paper smushed onto the shaving cream. Okay. Then you want to just carefully lift the paper up off of the shaving cream. And you can see we got our shaving cream filled paper and then you just want to 
again, scrape it right off and I'm just going to scrape it right off onto my table. Alright, once you got everything all scraped off, you want to just set your design aside to dry. This is what mine looks like right now, really cool, really colorful. And so I'm going to just set that aside so it can dry, clean up a little bit, and get ready for the next one. Thank you for joining us for Messy Monday. We got two really cool designs out of this. I hope that you and your family can create a lot of more interesting <laughs> paintings um, than we did today. But it's messy and it's fun and it's something that you can easily do at home. So thank you for joining us. I hope you enjoy and please join us again for our next week's Messy Monday.